In today's Wellness Wednesday, pack your picnic basket because July is National Picnic Month. And joining me on uh, now with some tips on how to have a healthy and filling picnic lunch is Albertson's dietitian Molly Tevis. Hey, good morning, Molly. Good morning. Thanks so much for having me. Absolutely. Okay, so summer, oh, these temperatures are so hot. It's it's a great time for fresh fruit and veggies. And maybe what should we be looking to pack for a day out? Well, just like you said, so really leaning on those fresh produce items, the colors of summer, they're going to provide us with antioxidants, vitamins, minerals, plus hydration. So as we're packing our picnic baskets, really throw in your fresh cut fruit, your vegetables. That way you have something nice, light and refreshing during the hot summer days if you're out there having a picnic. I love your picnic basket. It's so cute. Oh, I love it. So um, there's one particular item that you say we should be adding. What, what is it um, and, and uh, what would you suggest? Yeah, so in addition to a national picnic, picnic month, it is also National Blueberry Month. And blueberries are one of the highest antioxidant fruits among our most popular fruits. And they also provide fiber and again, hydration, so water. They're 85% water. So sneaking in those blueberries, a lot of times we think of them as just a sweet treat or a sweet fruit, but you can use them in some of those savory recipes. One of my favorites that I made for us this morning is this grilled corn salad, and then add in those blueberries. So you get a little sweet, a little savory, plus all the health benefits of adding in the blueberries. Wow, I would never think to put berries in something savory like that. That's so cool. Okay, I got to try that. Um, and also, it's about portability, right? So what kind of snacks do you have in mind for that if we're on the go? Yes, so I like pre-made wraps or sandwiches, kind of like my little BLT pita pockets that I have here, ready to go, something that you can take and wrap and throw in your picnic basket or in your cooler. And it's not going to be utensils or make a lot of mess or pre-chopped veggies little made charcuterie cups, something that's going to be simple and less work when you're sitting outside. I like it. Okay, now of course we have uh, some people who have a sweet tooth. What about those people on the go? What can we get them for dessert? Really lean into those fresh fruits of summer. We have local cherries and blueberries and watermelon in our stores right now and they're so refreshing. But if you're looking for a little something special, having some bite-sized sweet treats like brownies or bars keeping them small that way there's not a lot of mess they don't take up a lot of room in your basket or in your cooler plus then they're the perfect little portion to just give you that little bite that you want yeah okay i love all these ideas where can we find out more you can head into your local albertsons or go to albertsons.com molly thank you so much i love yeah i love picnic food basically i could eat a picnic just all the time but this especially with these hot temperatures i feel like people are really going to resonate with this and and yeah take you up on your uh, on your offer here just nice and light and refreshing to help beat the heat. Yeah, I love it. Thanks so much, Molly. We appreciate you, and that looks delicious. And now I have to put blueberries in something savory. That's my new challenge to myself.